So uh, we met in high school. Um, we just kind of passed each other by in the hallway and somehow I got her phone number. So I'd uh, yeah. shoot her those random texts trying to get her to hang out with me. It never really worked out. Eventually, after my second year of college, I was coming back to live at my parents' house and uh, sent her a text to grab ice cream with me. She finally, or actually I tried getting her to go to movies with me and then uh, she settled for ice cream, so. And then from there we've been together, so. To some people she has this kind of a tough exterior that she's just like hard to break into, but uh, when you get to know her she's just genuinely a really caring person and loves to be able to help out those who are less fortunate. continue to work towards your goals and always achieve them. Not only that, but you make one another achieve more by driving the other to be a better version of themselves. I couldn't be happier that Steph has someone to do that for her. Just look at this beautiful wedding that we're all at right now. Dear Guapa, our big day is finally here. I'm getting all those butterflies in my stomach feelings right now as I had when we started dating over six years ago. But thank you for allowing me to become part of your family. When I say that, I don't mean that I am now about to legally be part of your family, but I mean that they have all been so loving and accepting of me since day one. The love that they all have for each other is the kind of family love that I can't wait to instill in our future children. Everything is better when you're there. Stephanie, he is the loyalest man I have ever met. It's like some scientist took a golden retriever and put it inside a human being. I love you so much, Stephanie. I am so incredibly excited for not only everything that today has in store for us, but for everything that we have to look forward to for the rest of our lives as husband and wife. Love you always and forever, Tyler. Tyler.